Hello guys, I'm Denise and I'm from Russia, from far east of Russia, from Vladivostok. In this issue, uh, I'll uh, want uh, to show you a unique issue. Uh, this is a Russian news media, a Russian news state media, and uh, I translated for you uh, one episode from Russian news media uh, from one of the uh, channel uh, Russian news uh, of uh, YouTube. Uh, by the way, guys, I accelerated uh, some uh, episodes uh, in this uh, issue uh, with my translation because I couldn't catch uh, in English uh, this uh, person uh, in Russian news state media. Uh, he tells uh, very fast. Okay, let's get started. Vladimir Putin has imposed martial law on the occupied territories of Ukraine. My name is Igor Maximov. Hello. The president of Russia signed a decree on the introduction of martial law in the annexed territories of Ukraine. He stated this at a meeting of the Security Council. We are talking about the so-called DPR and LPR, as well as about the occupied parts of the Kherson and the Parvorsky regions. That is about the territories that Moscow has considered part of Russia since September. Kiev called Russia's decision a priesthood legalization of stolen Ukrainian territories. Well, Putin added that the martial law regime on these lands was in effect even before the annexions. And how now the Kremlin wants to formalize these measures within the framework of Russian legislation. According to the decree, martial law will come in for force from tomorrow. This regime implies a number of measures from the creation of territorial defense to the seizure of citizens' property if necessary. An average level of response is being introduced in eight more regions near Ukraine, including the next Crimea. This region may mean temporary resettlements of residents, a special regime for entering their regions and restriction on freedom of movement. In addition, in today's situation, I consider it necessary to give additional powers to the heads of all Russian regions. The corresponding decree was also signed today. The highest officials of the subjects of the Federation should pay the necessary attention, know the implementation of measures designed to ensure the safety of people, the protection and anti terrorist protection of critical facilities. In addition, a high readiness level is being introduced in the central and southern federal districts of Russia and a basic readiness level is being introduced in the rest of the country. Putin explained that he had made all these decisions because Ukraine rejects proposals for negotiations with Moscow, shells the territory of Russia and sends sabotage groups there. He recalled the explosion on the Crimean bridge. Ukraine has repeatedly warned that it will not tolerate the illegal seizure of its territories. Western countries also don't recognize the annexation of these regions by Moscow. Okay, guys, uh, now you watched uh, Russian news uh, state media episodes from Russian news state media. Uh, I know that you required uh, that uh, I comment this situation, this uh, news, uh, but uh, I think you get uh, that I can't comment this situation because uh, I live in this moment on the territory of uh, Russian Federation and uh, I can have problem because of this. Uh, but I can uh, tell neutrality opinion about this theme, about this topic. Uh, this is awful when uh, people, children, uh, kids, adults and uh, other, other people uh, suffer uh, from, uh, from or because of uh, other people. The war, it's uh, always uh, bad, it's always awful and scary. I think you agree with me. Uh, I don't want that uh, on our earth uh, will be war, uh, because uh, we can use uh, our resources uh, for good things and something good uh, for our planet, for medicine, for sick uh, people, and uh, other other uh, useful uh, types uh, of uh, different spheres on our earth. What about me, guys? I don't want uh, to the war with uh, other people because I don't want uh, to take blood uh, for my hands. Uh, this is uh, evil and this is very bad. I don't want uh, to make it. Uh, also, uh, can uh, our government uh, 
uh, summon me in our army in this moment? Uh, my answer, no. Uh, because in this moment I am student, I am cadet of university in Russia, and our government uh, don't touch uh, students uh, from university, from different universities and uh, other educational institutions. Uh, so in this uh, moment uh, I am in a safe. Uh, guys, if you like to watch my video, of course, subscribe on my channel, like this video, write below your opinion about this topic, about this military operation and other bad things uh, about uh, our planet. Uh, also on my channel you can uh, find uh, numerous good things. Uh, this is, of course, uh, different trips, travels about Primorsky region, uh, in future about uh, our world, about all Russia. This channel not only about politics. So, bye for now, see you later. Bye-bye, guys. Пока-пока.